Whoa. Hi guys, uh, Radical Firearms uh, and uh, as you can see I'm holding the incomplete uh, rifle in my hands. Uh, there is uh, no bolt carrier and no bolt and uh, the center is uh, background of, of my backyard so this cannot be good and uh, and it isn't. Uh, so what happened today uh, we were running uh, the another set uh, another thousand uh, rounds uh, to finish the test on the radical firearms and disaster happened. So uh, what happened was uh, during the barrel uh, performance test which consists of shooting a five rounds group and then dumping four mags and uh, you are reshooting the five uh, shots group again to see if the point of impact has changed. So when I went to that portion and started shooting uh, doing the magazine dumps, uh, I encountered numerous and numerous problems. Uh, suddenly, and it happened just like this, suddenly the rifle started choking uh, on the magazines, uh, the rounds were uh, not feeding forward, uh, uh, you know, it was a light primer strikes, so disaster after disaster. Light primer strike. Failure. It's a light primer strike. Nope. Failure. It's again light primer strike. So I removed the bolt carrier uh, and the bolt. And uh, you know, at first I thought maybe I screw up. Uh, you know, it's too much right now. Let's clean it. So I cleaned the, the bolt carrier, the bolt, uh, you know, nice uh, chamber. And uh, what I realized that the gas rings, uh, gas rings were totally blow out and uh, you know the, the easy test, the rifle was not testing the, uh, te the, not passing the test on the gas rings. Uh, so I had some used ones uh, in my toolbox, uh, I put it the used ones uh, and I thought it solved the problem. Uh, I, uh, I was able to go through like one, like one magazine dump and then again problem come back so at that uh, that moment i decided okay it's time to cut the test short uh, because uh, you know the rifle is not performing and the idea for the test is uh, to keep pushing the rounds down the pipe but i went back home and i took the rifle apart and check this out guys uh, this is really heartbreaking i pull out the bolt carrier and the bolt and as you can see the camshaft snapped uh, in half so uh, first there was a gas rings and now the the camshaft just snapped and uh, basically this just told, tells you you know I was very excited about this rifle uh, at the beginning you know through the first uh, 4,000 rounds uh, but as you can see the rifle uh, it's a it's a critical fail uh, you know this is game over uh, and uh, it just tells you that uh, we should wait oh there you go the second piece fall out right now that we should always wait with the with the opinions forming the opinions till the test is over and um, that's very unfortunate but it is what it is uh, we're not hiding anything uh, I'll make a picture so you can see what happened guys uh, but basically the, from from what I'm seeing here that that part just snapped uh, so uh, there was uh, there's some problem with uh, the gas rings I understand that the gas rings could wear out but uh, I was a little bit surprised that uh, they were out so fast uh, but this this is I have seen this happen before but uh, at the much higher uh, rounds count this is something uh, which shouldn't happen in my eyes at such a low uh, rounds count um, and um, and you know that's it that's basically it the game is over uh, bad news and very disappointing because uh, it, it was you know really that rifle I liked that rifle I told you that before uh, but this uh, got me question right now uh, you know really they saying that it's a mil spec parts and uh, okay whatever this is their statement on the website so that is a little bit disappointing to see all right please let me know if you have any questions thanks for watching